Okay, welcome to um, my gameplay of Portal 2. So let's jump into it. And um, this game does have co op, so you can play it with your mate or whatever. Um, let's jump into single campaign. Uh, new game. I have started this once before, but I am wanna my wanna make a no no uh, gameplay for you guys. Um, before I get into it, um, I want to ask you to please write, subscribe, and comment on this video, and I will make more for you guys. Um, and uh, yeah, this is a uh, co-op. A puzzle game so um, I don't think there are any online capabilities at all so um, yeah good luck on that one <laughs> if you want to play online um, but this is not the game for you if you want to do that if you want to do a game like that get like I don't know GTA 5 or something good morning you have been in suspension for and, um, yeah. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. What? Uh, look up. Okay. Good. Up. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Down. Good. I'm looking down. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Okay, where's the painting? This there? is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Okay, stare at that. Staring at that. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Um. Good. Now please return to your bed. Okay. Sleep. I like sleep. I should do it more often. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Hello? Oh, Anyone in there? People at the door. Hello? Ah! Ah! Oh, gone, gone. You look te um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you... Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. This can't be good. Safe. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Well, I would if I could. I back right, away slowly. There. Can you hear me? Hello? Hello. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months. So yeah, if if you guys play this uh, game, longer, game before, please let me know in the comments below. You have a very minor case of serious brain damage, but don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. 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 Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh crap. Okay, look, I wasn't gonna mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How you doing down there? You still holding on? I'm trying to. Reserve so. power ran out. So of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, I hope you know how to drive no, this thing, you idiot. Tell me anything. Why should I be kept informed? You know about the life functions of the ten thousand bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. 
Why? It's close. Can you see? Doing a very well, shit job of driving this thing. Uh, just, just gotta get through here. Okay, I just gotta concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. You think? Okay, listen. We should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Alright? Not alive, dead. Alive, not dead. Okay, uh, yeah. almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're gonna need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. How do you think? How do you know? You don't know. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm gonna attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Okay. Well, there we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But, um, at least you're a good jumper. So, you got that, got the jumping on your side. Um, <laughs> just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Okay, you're gonna go away, or am I gonna have to stay out of your right. favor? off you go. Go on, just march on through that hole. The glass, you idiot. That's the spirit. <laughs> Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. Toilet. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic yeah. significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Okay, I'm gonna go for the hull. Sorry about the dog barking uh, in the background. Cube and button based testing remains an important tool Sorry. for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Okay. Yeah, Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. Right, I think we just completed test one. Test. I don't know. I have played this game once before, but it is a very long time, so... If yeah. you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. I know this test one, okay. And button press. Pick it up, come on. Thank you. And now I want to dump it. I want to press that button. And I'm playing this on the Xbox. Um, I think it come on PS3 and PC uh, too. Um, I'm just not sure. Um, yeah. 
So um, if you if you look good, because of the if you're looking for a puzzle, puzzle type game, is unsupervised. Um, this is the game for you if not well. The conclusion of testing. Please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An aperture science reintegration associate will remind I, you. I I would recommend this game, but it um, does get a little bit complicated uh, if you go. Right to the end, it does get a, a little bit complicated, but um, yeah, depending on how how this video goes on YouTube, I will put up more videos. If the Earth is guys. currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Um, I'm gonna actually um end the video here. Before we go into chapter two, so we're gonna yeah end the video here and um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you comment, write, subscribe, and I will talk.